Hey guys, today I'm going to be sharing with you my current hair care routine. I feel like I have very curly, frizzy, hard to manage hair and I thought if your hair is anything like mine then this video would probably be really helpful to you. I feel like I've gotten my hair routine down really well lately and I'm loving everything that I've been using so let's just go ahead, jump right into it and I'll share with you guys everything that I've been doing. All right, so hair care all starts in the shower, right? For those of you that don't know, I am a certified cosmetologist, so of course I'm gonna say definitely get yourself a good shampoo and conditioner. I'm gonna show you guys my most favorite shampoo and conditioner that has just completely changed the texture of my hair, just how it feels, everything it just, feels amazing. A while back, maybe a year ago, I bleached out my hair really light and it was very hard on my hair. It was just breaking and that's the main reason why I had to cut it off. It's finally starting to get long again. I want to give some credit to this shampoo right here. It's by Pureology. It's a little pricey. I would say Pureology is like the very best shampoo and conditioner money can buy but it is a little bit more expensive these aren't the huge bottles and i don't use them every single time i try to just use them for like special occasions and i only wash my hair about once or twice a week but this specific shampoo and conditioner by pureology is called nano works and what's so special about it is after you use it seven times it says that your hair is supposed to feel like virgin hair again. I don't know if my hair feels like virgin hair again or not, but it does feel really great ever since I've been using this shampoo and conditioner. If I'm not using this, I usually am using a sleek and smoothing shampoo and conditioner that I have, like really big gallon sizes of by Matrix. And I really like that too, just for kind of like an everyday shampoo. But if you really want your hair to feel healthy and amazing, if your hair has been damaged in the past by chemicals and stuff, invest in this and it will completely change the health of your hair. So it's definitely pricier, but totally worth it. So right when I get out of the shower, I usually keep my hair wrapped up in a towel for a good bit, especially because I always kind of like dread drying it and stuff and I'm always like sweating and stuff. But that routine has changed too, which I'll share with you guys in just a second what I've been doing with that. But once I take my hair out of the towel, before I even brush it or anything, I spray this It's a 10 in my hair. I've been using this stuff, I feel like ever since it came out, so maybe like three or four years, I don't remember, but I've been using it nonstop ever since. I use the one that also has keratin in it. Keratin is so good for your hair. It's the protein that your hair is made out of. And a lot of times if you're coloring your hair a lot, your hair needs some more keratin. So this makes my hair feel so silky, so amazing. It's called It's a 10 because it has like 10 benefits that it does for your hair. But I usually spray this in, kind of use it, use it as a detangler, and then I go through with my most favorite brush ever. I've also been using this brush ever since these came out too. It's a wet brush. You guys have probably heard of these before. It's kind of gross because I use it all the time and there's a little bit of hair in it. But if you have never used a wet brush before, you have to because it will change your life. So I usually spray this in and then I comb through my hair afterwards. I've gone through so many of these brushes at first. I thought I could even use it like with my blow dryer on it, but came to realize that doesn't work and it'll melt these bristles. So I usually just use it if I'm brushing my hair dry or like I said, right when I get out of the shower and after I spray my it's a tenon, I usually just brush it all out. This is also a great combo. If you have a daughter who hates having her hair brushed or her hair gets really tangly all the time, this will be your best Friend. This is like a lifesaver and just a miracle in a bottle. So after I use my It's a 10, I also do like to put a cream product in my hair because my hair is so coarse and frizzy. If you don't have very coarse, frizzy hair, I don't think that you have to have a cream product in your hair. But this is the one I've been using lately by Brio Geo. And I think I got this in a BoxyCharm box and it's almost gone. But what I love about this product is that it does have heat protectant in it. And I feel like that's really important for me 
just for the integrity of my hair and I'm constantly putting heat on it all the time. So this also makes my hair look really shiny and it really just tames down a lot of that frizz. So I've been loving this ever since I got it. So as soon as I'm done with this, I'm going to have to get another one, but I don't use a ton of it. I probably just use like the size of a quarter and then run it all throughout my hair. But I really love this for just kind of, you know, keeping that frizz and curl down out of my hair because I don't wear my hair curly very often I usually am wearing it straight because I got a whole different routine for if I'm wearing my hair curly and then the last thing I like to put on my hair this isn't something that I use every time but I do use it a lot of times this is by the brand KMS and it's free shape quick blow dry spray what's really cool about this is that it really does make the blow dry process a lot shorter it seems like so that's crazy and then this also has heat protectant on it as you guys can tell i'm really obsessed with heat protectant i just do not want heat damage on my hair in my hair i don't want to cut it and if i have any damage on my hair i just feel like i just need to cut it all off because it's just breaking off all the time so how i use this i basically just shake it up Spray it all over my hair, maybe five or six sprays, and then I start my blow dry process. So this is the Revlon brush roller that I've been using lately to blow dry my hair. I just talked about this in my favorites video that I just filmed too because I am absolutely obsessed with this. If your hair is anything like mine, you need to get this brush because it literally cut the blow dry time in half. If your arm gets tired, if you just don't like blowing, blowing out your hair, if it's hard for you, if you have curly hair, whatever, this thing is amazing. So I think it's normally about $60 and then I got mine from Ulta. I had a coupon. I think I got mine for around $40. It has just been a complete game changer for me blow drying my hair. It's a million times easier than blowing out my hair with a bunch of round brushes and I honestly feel like my hair gets silkier and shinier using this thing. So definitely try this thing out if you guys are looking for something to blow dry your hair with. I don't even need a blow, regular blow dryer anymore. I really just need this. It just makes life so much easier. So whether you have coarse curly hair like mine or whether your hair is thinner, whatever, it just makes you look like you have a really nice blowout and I love this thing. Revlon blow dryer. I usually like to go through and straighten my hair because you know it does give me a little bit of body and a little bit of curl at the end but for me I don't really care for that look. I like my hair to be a little bit more straight. The next thing I do is I go ahead and I spray heat protectant all over my hair and this is the one I use by KMS Free Shape. It's called Hot Flux Spray. I've been using this one for years and I've never had a problem with it. I love it. And then I go through with my straightening brush that I recently just got. I probably got it a month ago, but ever since I got it, I've been using it almost every single day. It's by the brand Amika. So because I'm a cosmetologist, I can go into the professional beauty stores and get products at a discounted price. So I'm really grateful for that. But it goes up to 450 degrees. And on my hair, because it's so coarse and curly, I usually do use it at 450. But if your hair is not that coarse, I definitely wouldn't suggest having it up that high. But really, it's super simple to use. All I have to do is just run it through, literally, like a regular brush. I might do it two times through each 
chunk of hair but it's so much easier than using a straightener because I feel like I can take bigger chunks and it really stays straight with a flat iron I could never wear my hair straight it just didn't stay straight and I had a really I still do have a really nice flat iron but it just it doesn't do the trick like this thing does and this is so much faster than using a regular flat iron too because you're literally just brushing your hair. So this thing is amazing. If you straighten your hair, whether your hair is like mine or not, definitely check one of these things out. I've seen a few different brands have uh, straightening brushes like this now. So I'll try to find a few different ones and leave them linked below. I'll also link this one below too because obviously this one is going to be my most favorite. It's the only one I've tried but I'll try to link some other ones down below too. But yeah, after I've been using this then that is pretty much it for my hair routine. Sometimes if I feel like my hair is a little bit frizzy or if it's going to be humid out I might run a little bit of a serum through my ends or something but for the most part that is it. So I really hope that you guys liked checking out my current hair care routine. If you guys did enjoy watching this video please make sure to find that thumbs up button below and go ahead and click it for me. Also, if you guys are new to my channel or you just haven't subscribed yet, please make sure to go ahead and find that subscribe button below. It'll subscribe you to my channel and that way you'll be notified every single time I post a video. So I hope you guys are having a great week. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you really soon in my next video.